Looking for a newly constructed three bedroom townhouse in Apple Valley featuring an open concept and updates galore? Well, we got you covered. Roll that intro. Hey, this is Michael Getty with Mozzie Properties, and today I'm bringing you a video walkthrough tour of 15594 Everglade Avenue here in Apple Valley. It is of the newly constructed three bedroom townhouse behind me. It's really beautiful, I'm excited to show it to you. Uh, but be sure if you like what you see in the video, check out the description below where I post things like rent price, availability date, and links to that itself. Now without further ado, let's get the show on the road. So, here is the back slash front side of the property. We got the garage door right here. And you can see we're in a new community being built over here in Apple Valley. Beautiful townhomes. We are right across from guest parking and the playground, which works it great for, makes it great for having guests over. Also, if you've got kids, I want to go use the playground. Just gonna see a little brief overview. We're in the newer part of Apple Valley where there is, you know, the, the Target, and the Crooked Pint, and other good restaurants and shops right nearby. I'm going through the garage to show it, so you can see nice two-car garage, water spout. Really straightforward. Let's head on in and check it out. All right, so upon entering, come into the lower level. And the lower level features this really nice family room. Sitting so up the stairs that lead up to the next level. We'll head up there in just a few. So this room down here works really well for actually several purposes. I mean, it works great as an additional family room. Works well as an office, as it's kind of on its own level. Also, while well, you don't have a door here, if you're needing somebody that wants a main level bedroom, this works really well too. You've got your plenty of space here. There's a bathroom off the side. I'll go show it in just a second. Uh, but could work well with a little partition over there. On the back, you do have your mechanicals. Show you your water heater, furnace AC. And then over here, we have a bathroom, a toilet, sink vanity, a little coat closet. And this, this home just got done being built. So you'll see new finishes all throughout as we look. This door leads out to, I mean, you could call it the front door, but it's really more of the back. And in the spring, they're gonna be going ahead and putting down grass and sod out here. Backs up to a nice big valley. You can see you've got the parks right there, the park systems at Apple Valley. There's Pizza Ranch, Target, so you're right near uh, shopping as well. All right, now let's head on up and this next level, so it's three levels, the main level that we just came in on, uh, I guess I'd call it the lower level, the main level right here, and then the upstairs. And this level is easily my favorite. And you will see why. So we have this beautiful kitchen, stainless steel appliances, Beautiful countertops, and look at how open this is. Beautiful center island. Yes, beautiful. You can see tons of closet space. This flows down here to the family room area. Don't worry, we'll go back and do a little more deep dive to the kitchen, but I just kind of want to show this at a glance here so you can see everything. There's the stairs leading up to the bedroom area. And one thing that's also really nice is the blinds in this house. So all these blinds are the ones that are really easy. You can just push it up, pull it down. Nice, thick blinds. Very nice as far as that goes. Big space right here works really well for a kitchen or dining table. Put your couch, TV, chair over here. You may notice, kind of as I mentioned, tons of storage space. So if you want to make this be dry pantry, just additional storage. 
really whatever you'd like. You have all this space here, including a third closet door over here. This one's more designed for the pantry with the additional shelving, but you can really kind of use it however you'd like. So just doing a little deeper dive of the kitchen, we got the dishwasher right here. We've got our sink. And again, with the front facing windows here, you can see there's still some construction going on, more houses to come up, but you've got the playground right across. So kind of nice to be able to have that in your line of sight. You've got your microwave, gas stove. And over here, we've got our fridge, stainless steel, water dispenser. And then it's the little things too, like the center islands have outlets on them, which is really nice. And I don't know if you noticed, but the one over there also had USB ports, so just very nice. We've got patio right out here. So we have the maintenance-free siding. Nice large space here. I'll step out, I'm in socks, so I'll just try not to step on any water, but See, nice big, nice big deck. And then kind of overlooking the neighborhood out here. Okay, let's head back inside. Now the last thing that's on this level too, don't want to miss it, because every bathroom is important. Uh, we have another one, right as you come up the stairs, there's a bathroom off here, when you have guests and entertaining. So you've got a toilet, and sink. And a little mirror that looks out. So there's a bathroom, at least a bathroom on every level, which is really nice. We'll do one last look down here, and then we'll head on up. Just in case I didn't show it too, we'll go. So you got the parks that are right there, baseball fields, shopping, than your field that leads up to it. All right, let's head on upstairs. Check out those bedrooms. Right, going on up. We've got three bedrooms, so we have two that are down on the end of the hallway, and then the master that's right here. We'll go ahead and show that one first. It's a nice large room with three windows overlooking the front of the house. One thing that's really nice about this is we have the master bathroom. We have our stand-up shower here with glass door. Dual sink, nice large mirror. Toilet in its own room for privacy. Linen closet in the bathroom for storage. And then over here we have our walk-in closet. See, good size closet. All right, now heading down this way, got two more bedrooms also right here. We have the washer and dryer, a little storage rack up above. Those are included with the rental. Over here we have our shared bathroom, so that makes four bathrooms total. Sink vanity, toilet, and then tub shower. We have a common linen closet. And then our two bedrooms. Here's the first bedroom. See, you got a little bump out here. A little character, a little extra room. And then we've got a closet that goes back a little ways on the other side on a sliding door. And then lastly, the other room. Oops. 
there you have it. All right, well, that concludes the tour of this property. If you have any other questions, be sure to let me know. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye now. Thanks for watching our video tour. If you're interested in applying for the property, check out the video up here to see how to do our online rental application process. If it wasn't quite what you were looking for, you can browse our other active listings over here as well to see what else we have on the market. Otherwise, be sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified with any new content. Thanks so much and have a great day.